uh, I, I, I have thought that I knew, uh, and I certainly can pin this down if there's any doubt about it, that what Harriman's been working on is this New York play for, for Bobby. Yeah, he has. He's yeah. been working on that very hard, and I, I connected this uh, reception. I read this in the newspaper. I haven't talked to everybody today. I connected that reception with, uh, with a send-off for Bobby in New York. Maybe it. Maybe it. Yeah, Maybe it. but I certainly can... Uh, no, I don't think... I think we just write it out, just watch it. Yeah. I think it's a good thing, though, for for him to keep us informed. Uh, not necessarily me, but uh, right. because he might not want to, but he might... Uh, I think he ought to keep you informed about right. what he's doing because uh, um, uh, this is a very, very ambitious young man. And uh, you just... It's unbelievable how ambitious he is. Well, uh, Mr. President, I, uh, I commented to uh, Abbott today that um, I just can't wrap my mind around that kind of ambition. I don't, I don't know how to understand it. I don't either. This don't consuming either. passion is something that just alienates my whole makeup. It is. It's, uh, there's a ruthlessness about it that just scares yes. the hell out of me. Well, it is to me, too. It is to, and if you'd see what, uh, what's your question, for instance, she called me up at the ranch and demanded, just demanded, and I send in the internal revenue agents uh, all over Mississippi. Yeah, yeah. And I just got shocked by it and uh, the things he said about it. Uh, um, anyway, maybe it'll, maybe it'll work out the next few days. I hope we'll get through this convention out of trouble. I, I'm very fearful that uh, if you'll see the columns and everything. The last two days I've spent half my time denying to the columns that I have abandoned the Kennedy machine. I've thrown it overboard. Now, whatever it is, I don't know.